Hello everybody, in this video I'll show you how you can record pass-through with your Quest 2 VR headset with a few simple steps. So if you don't have time for lots of tutorial, long tutorials, just follow these steps. Keep in mind this is intended for Windows. First make sure that your Quest 2 VR headset is connected using USB to your PC. Also make sure to approve the connection in the headset. Next, go to this uh, and download this open source software from GitHub. Uh, this is a Windows version, as I mentioned. Choose either 64-bit or 32-bit, depends on your operating system uh, type. Now, next, you need to go to the folder and extract the files because it's going to be zipped. Next, click the Windows uh, key and then type CMD. You're going to see Command Prompt. Right-click on the Command Prompt and do Run as Administrator. Now inside the command prompt window, we need to change to the directory where the files are located. So the command is a cd space and then the path. So for example, in my case is c users, my PC, downloads and the entire thing. So I just need to put cd and then this entire path. Uh, you need to do the same, but again, depends where you actually downloaded the file and extract it. You can copy it from explorer window and paste it there. Just remember to put cd change directory, cd space and the path and press enter. Then all you need to do next is write the command shown in yellow, in your source copy slash scrub and all the different parameters there and press enter. Once you do that, uh, a new window will open that will show you the pass-through, not the pass-through, but basically what the Quest 2 headset sees. But if you're using pass-through, it will show you the pass-through as well. Now make sure you write the command uh, properly. If you get that the command not found, probably you misspell the uh, SCR CPY command. So make sure to everything to write it properly. And again, if it doesn't work for you, let me know in the comment section below and I will try to help you out solve the issues if you are experiencing any. And again, if it worked for you, let me know as well. Thanks for watching everybody. Again, you can also play with the parameters to increase, for example, the quality and change uh, the other settings. For this actually works very well for me. And this is the one that I use. Again, if you need any help, let me know in the comment section below. Thanks for watching.